Hey. Barry? It's Caitlin. I think I know why you're calling. It's over, Rathaway. You know my name. I know some names, too. Caitlin Snow, Cisco Ramon, Harrison Wells. Looks like you're not as smart as everyone says. Smart enough to have figured out who Harrison Wells really is. You see, I know his secret. Being scooped up by a guy clad in head-to-toe leather is a long-time fantasy of mine, so thanks. Well, 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 the gang's all here. You've lasted a lot longer than I would have thought, Cisco. And you didn't last 10 seconds against the Flash. Hmm. I was thinking of calling myself Pied Piper. Hey, I assigned the nicknames around here. Although that one's not bad. Caitlin, never did get that wedding invite. Shut the hell up. Stay in front of me. I assume you were all listening. Well, Hartley was telling the truth. I have not been honest with you. With any of you. <laughs> the accelerator. Hartley warned me that there was indeed a chance that the accelerator could explode. His data did not show 100% certainty. Just that there was a risk, but it was a real risk. And yet I made the decision that the reward, that everything we could learn, that everything we could achieve, that all of that simply outweighed that risk. I'm sorry. the next time you choose to put our lives and the lives of the people that we love at risk, I'll expect a heads up. After the explosion, when everyone else left you, Caitlin and Cisco stood by you. You owe them more than an apology. They might soon get more than that, what with Hartley so intent on sending me to the next world. Wait. That wouldn't make it right with them. You broke their trust, our trust. 